What's up? Yo. Man. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Pyrotechnic Plays on Pyrotechnic. And today, I'm back on my itch.io kick. I mean, it's been a while, right? I haven't been doing the itch.io thing. I need to be doing the itch.io thing. So I downloaded Return. Or uh, re Turn. So. I... I have... I don't know. I, I don't want to spoil these things for me. Shall we? Oh. Really? It, ooh, it can be played with... Ooh. So, WASD. F is flashlight. Huh. Okay. How you guys doing? This was... That was pretty intense. E? As expected of Kazuki, the Emperor of Horror and Mystic. I think I almost peed my pants. Saki, you were in... S S S Saki? Saki? You were in silence all the time. What's wrong? Sorry, did I miss something? Gah. Queen Saki. How dare you miss my indestructible mystical urban tale session. You break my fragile heart. Saki, are you okay? It doesn't seem... It doesn't seem you catch a fever. That's a relief. English. Huh. I guess I'm just tired, that's all. It's a very exhausting day. It's the first day of the trip, after all. I agree. My hands are still hurt from setting up the tent. Look at these blisters. Look at this blister. Ouch! Ah! Stop it, Kazu! Yuta, be strong! Don't let your youth be wasted. Look at Sin! That passionate eyes. That shining face. A glance can tell how loosened his future will be. Uh, even this fire can't cover his bright destiny. What do you? Ex How do you expect me to respond to that? Translation's a bit off, but we'll work with it. We got this. We got this. I can't believe our sin will be the first one to mature. Right? When sin announced the engagement, I was in shock too. I can't believe the Saki would accept this geek. Nah, he has been and always will be more mature than you guys anyway. Sin, whatever happens, don't disappoint us. More importantly, Saki, okay? I won't. Ever. That was so cool, Sin. What? You have a thing for him? I guess you're all getting too tired already. Let's take a breather now. Good night. Rest well, Saki. The fuck is going on? Who's there? Sen? Kazuki? Yuta? Kana? Looks like they won't be back anytime soon. I should probably check the surroundings a bit. Ooh. Burnt firewoods left from the campfire. It's already wet now. I remember I put my flashlight in this bag. It should be in this pocket. Or here. Ah. Here it is. Obtained a flashlight. I should probably bring this along too. Obtained a notebook. Ooh. Ooh. I said I had a sleeping tent for the boys. The beds are cold. There, what's the inventory? I like this so far, it's pretty cool. Okay, so inventory interact confirm. Yeah, okay.
Who, who's there? I like the, uh, the, the, the style of it so far. It's pretty nice. Well, I guess the translation is a little weird, but we can get nothing. You have nothing to say about the graves? Ouch. What was that? Oh, no. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Two tombstones stand still in the ground. On surface, Mom and Dad are written. Did I walk on the tombstone? Water. Look. Something's in the water. I obtained a kniff. I can kniff people. Clear jade-colored lake. In the middle of it, a willow tree. Keep a silent watch. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> how how does one use kniff? For cutting to grass. Yes. Okay. Duh, 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 duh. I'm not complaining. Still good. <clears throat> Fuck that. <laughs> Fuck that shit right there. You see that shit? Fuck that shit. I'm good on that shit. You ever just... Ah, that's probably just one of my friends. Everything's fine. Ah. Someone's there. Wait. <clears throat> Hold on. I want to give you a back massage. You like back massages, right? A huge batch, patch of bushes blocks the road. I need a sharp object to cut these. If only I had a canoe. Let's cut these bushes. Yes. Let's. The rusty cuckoo breaks into pieces from the grass. My kniff has died. Rip kniff. Says I can move up and down, but I don't think I can. Train tunnel. Really though, is it? Is it a train tunnel? Was there trains? That tree is purple right there. I see the train town. Was it this way? Where did they go? That's... It's a fucking train out of nowhere. I like the art style. Art style is very visually appealing. A train? And an old one, too. I had no idea there was a railway passing through here. I got a bad feeling about this, but... It will be fine. Everything's fine. Sagi just... Mm, Sakai, just go and... It's just... I'll just have a peek. And if they're really here, that's even... That's more of a reason for me to go in. What you doing is... Some resin... Ooh, some... Ooh. This is very visually appealing. I like how, like, like this, uh, that one lamp on the left there is broken, and this one, like that one doesn't have a light bulb, this one does have a light bulb, and this one over here has both of its shades. That's nice. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, alright, one sec, a tattered notebook. Half the contents are missing. An open curtain. There's a bulge beneath the folds. Paint thinner spray? <laughs> the sounds cut too. Other than that though, yeah, I'm really enjoying this. This is just for the the game creator and be like, ah oh, yes. Better translation, don't cut sounds, very nice, good review. But I am, the art style is Nice train. A fire extinguisher, there is handprint on handle. <laughs> That'll make up for the translation, make it sound natural. A locker. 
It is locked. <laughs> Alright. So, the sounds are pretty good, too. Like I'm walking on metal. I'm here in the metal. Ooh, save point. Ooh. Well, what perfect timing. Because that's all the time I have for this episode of Pyrotechnic Plays. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked it, buttons. You know what to do. Uh, I pretty much uh, went away from my usual live streaming. I figured I'd go back to the recording method. But uh, yeah, anyway, I'll see you guys in the next episode.